The audio portion of this video is being recorded with the DJI mic. This is the receiver, here's the transmitter, and of course I'm wearing this one. I'm just one person, and even though this one includes two, I'm only using one mic. The video you're seeing is on the Mevo start system. Here, let me give you a quick show around here. This is the camera we're not using here. So you can see, this is the Mevo Multicam app. That's camera one, that would be my camera, and this is our product camera here. Okay, let's get back to business. Here's why I'm doing this video. Uh, I've already done a review on this right here. The DJI mic, it's $330. The reviews on GadgetGuru.com and on my YouTube channel, which you're watching right now. At some point, I'll put a link up top so that you can see it. This thing's just gotten really good reviews. It's a very well-designed mic. It works. It includes almost everything you need. When I say almost, well, pretty much everything. Uh, you get a cable so you can connect it directly into a camera. But here, let me go and go over to this camera. But you also get your, your lightning and USB-C connectors. Uh, here, let me show you how this works, because this is interesting. That they're in the case. It just slides right in, very easy to use. The reason we're here today is this right here. DJI just started shipping its DJI mic. They're affectionately calling it the 1TX plus 1RX model. Simply stated, this is the same as this DJI mic, except you don't get a charging case, and it only has one transmitter. You still get a receiver, you still get those cool USB and lightning connectors that slide right into the back, and of course you also get a little hot shoe thing that slides in there, that's in here somewhere. You get a wind muff, and you get a connection cable uh, for your DSLR. Now, let me tell you what's interesting. Instead of having a charging case, you get this pigtail adapter. They didn't give you a charging brick, but this way you can charge both the receiver and the uh, transmitter or microphone, you know, at, at one time, you know, without having a bunch of messy wires or, you know, again, that, that's a pretty good solution. The question is, is this worth $100 more than that? Well, in my opinion, let me tell you, if you're going to go on and buy a wireless microphone system, getting a dual right up front is a good idea. But if you don't, this is $330. This is $100. This, this is not a bad idea. Now, I'm going to close out with this, and I think this is interesting. In fact, it might be one of the most interesting things I've seen all year. Now, as you know, if you watch my previous Mevo Start video, I just was not a fan of their built-in microphones. Now, granted, if you're recording religious service or you're in a hall where, where you have sound everywhere, it's not a bad thing. But if you're trying to do an interview or if you're, you know, just have two or three people around in a room that just does not have good acoustics, it doesn't sound that good. Now, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to unplug the DJI mic from this Mevo Start camera right here. And... I want you to listen to this for a moment. Okay, I've unplugged the microphone, and I want you to listen to this and pay close attention to the audio, not what I'm saying, because that's going to be gibberish. The Mevo Start Starter Pack includes three cameras, charging cables, and a microfiber cloth, and sells for $1,000. Now, listen to this. I'm going to play back that recorded segment again. Okay, I've unplugged the microphone, and I want you to listen to this and pay close attention to the audio, not what I'm saying, because that's going to be gibberish. The Mevo Start Starter Pack includes three cameras, charging cables, and a microfiber cloth, and sells for $1,000. Okay, I'm back on the DJI mic, and I moved down to my living room, and I'm going to tell you why. Whenever I'm putting microphones through their paces or offering demonstrations, instead of just showing it into a soundproof studio, I'd like to show them in environments the same way that you would be using them. I'm in my living room. We have tall ceilings. I have glass over here on the other side, and it's a wide room. I do have carpet down here, but you can hear all this sounds. Now, here's what I'm going to do. In fact, I've set up a second Mevo camera right behind us, so you can see there's no tricks. I'm now going to disconnect the DJI mic, and you're going to hear the same thing coming from the internal Mevo cameras. We are now using the Mevo internal microphone. I'm only about four feet away. In fact, I'll kind of lean into it so I can give it as much advantage as I can. 
As I said, the room has echoes. It's a large volume room. Now, what I'm going to do right here, without me stopping, you just heard the audio change. All I can tell you right now, it's artificial intelligence. And to process this portion of the video took a matter of seconds. This is a technology I'm following very close. And let me tell you, companies such as Mevo and even the DSLR makers who have these built-in cam or microphones on these $3,000 cameras that sound like garbage. This is something that could be a game changer and can affect the way that we record quality audio in the future. I'll have more stories on this, whether it's the next video or the one after that, who knows, but I'm doing my homework now. So don't forget to subscribe. That's it for now. I'm the Gadget Guru, Andy Farr.